On Days of Our Lives, a new power player has emerged recently. His name is Alex, as we all know. Whether Victor intended it or not, the money and power left to him by his father allowed him to gain control of Titan. All of this, though, is just one major error for the viewers who don't buy it. There is no proof that Theresa altered Angelica's letter to Victor outlining everything, but the show's recreation of Theresa's discovery of the letters in a flashback with Emily O'Brien as the character looks to be a major red flag. She also continues to encircle Alex, lending him her support as he adjusts to all of these changes. It's simple to understand why. Alex now has wealth and influence. Theresa can partake in that if she attaches her wagon to him. She may be Alex's Victor's Maggie. Except, you know, Maggie would have fallen in love with Victor while Theresa would be actively seeking it. Speaking of Maggie, however, rumors are that she'll get a surprise visitor on Thursday, Constantine, as we know him from the most recent issue of Soap Opera Digest. And just that alone raises some red flags. Although there is no information on what Victor's Greek friend is doing in Salem, the idea that he would simply go halfway around the world to express his sorrow seems like a stretch. In fact, this might be the opportunity Theresa conspiracy enthusiasts have been looking forward to. Constantine didn't know what was in the letters when Brady and Alex visited him, but when he does, he might have some insight, and it needn't be a huge surprise. In instance, it may be a seemingly innocent question like, Angelica, she and Victor didn't seem to me to be taking things seriously, but there was another woman. In the event that Constantine describes either Xander's mother or Justin's mother, this is where things might get interesting. Majid, of course, wouldn't necessarily take that to signify anything because neither she nor we. However, it might set events in motion that could make Alex's status as the hair appear to be a fraud. Because everyone is currently simply accepting the letter at face value. But if people started to wonder, they might ultimately determine that a quick DNA test is necessary. On the other hand, if Constantine starts ranting about Angelica and Victor and their complex relationship right away, we might find out later on that this whole thing was a red herring. In that instance, the Rosa is merely utilizing the circumstance rather than generating it. In any case, she is playing a risky game, and we don't see how this can finish with her looking good. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel, Daily Bulletin News, and stay with us.